Do you know why the infinity symbol looks like this? Why it wraps around like that? To explain why infinity looks like that, what we're going to do is treat infinity as if it was another real number. Now, this is a very dangerous thing to do, but for the sake of this argument, let's treat infinity as if it was another real number. So we are going to adjoin the infinity to the real numbers. And then the real numbers have an addition and a multiplication. So we have to know how infinity works under addition and multiplication. And some intuitive uh, operations would be that infinity plus infinity is infinity. And infinity times infinity is infinity. But if infinity plus infinity equals infinity, that would say that twice infinity is infinity, which means that infinity is zero. And if infinity times infinity equals infinity, then infinity squared would be infinity. And if you treat infinity as x as a variable, it would say that infinity is zero or one. But if, if infinity was one, this would say that two equals one, which is false. So infinity must be zero. So what happens if infinity was in fact zero? Then in the real line, we would have zero, one, two, and then we would approach infinity, but infinity is zero, so it would wrap around. So instead of drawing the real line as a line, we could wrap it around so that at infinity, we approach zero. So we have one, two, three, etc., and then it grows, and then it goes to zero, which is infinity. Oh, but this is interesting because now this looks like one of the sides of the infinity symbol. So then maybe we should also add minus infinity to the real numbers, in which case minus infinity minus infinity would be minus infinity, but minus infinity times minus infinity would be infinity, which is equal to zero, which would mean that minus infinity is also equal to zero. And then what we would get is that as we approach minus infinity in the real line, we also approach zero, and when we approach infinity on the real line, we also approach zero, which gives you this infinity pattern. Now, none of what I just said is actually true. It's fun, but I just made it up. If you actually want to know the reason why we use the symbol infinity, I have another video about the actual history of the infinity symbol. So go watch it.